everybody. Today we're going to take a very quick look at this paper. Basically, they were able to teleport uh, energy. Um, so it's widely known that uh, information about quantum states can be transported. Less well known that energy can be similarly transmitted. Um, QET, quantum energy teleportation, has never been confirmed by an experiment. Um, even though it can be achieved with a very simple system, they were able to do it using IBM quantum computers. I'm going to skip over the math. I don't understand it. I understand step one. Uh, they refer to this LOCC, so it's local system and classical communication. Don't know what that is. Step two, receive energy. Pretty straightforward. <laughs> uh, and then implications. So with respect to different phases, it's important to note that uh, energy can also be transmitted only by uh, this local system. Um, so it could, uh, this re reproducing this experiment could be done soon. Um, so they, there's a lot of hype here. They say it could bring uh, about a revolution in, um, where is that? Revolution in quantum communication technology. I don't know. I'm not really in the field, but it looks interesting. They give some examples. Uh, for example, their long distance quantum network. There's one in Long Island and other quantum networks have been developed. Um, yeah, they they predict around the 2030s. I don't know. Seems unlikely. I'm pretty anti-hype. But it would be a big deal. They talk about trading um, energy like you would on a grid. Here's the paper. I asked chat GPT to give me a summary of this paper. So I said, write a summary. Then I give them the information. And I give the abstract. Um, and they, I think they did a good job. So that's all I have for you today. Let me know what you think of this. Is it uh, important? Is it hype? Is it accurate? Um, let me know. All right. Bye-bye.